Hey guys, what's going on? Drax here, back again with another episode of Ark Survival Evolved here on the Pooping Evolved server. I am got some news for you guys. I am on a fresh install of Windows 10. I upgraded from Windows 7 Home Premium. Upgraded a little bit of my RAM. I went from 16 gigs to 32 gigs. And uh, it looks like it reset my, my keybinds for my... Um, my waving and my my taunt. I believe that's the taunt. Uh, no, no, not the taunt. Uh, salute. Yeah, there it is. That's the salute. That's what I wanted. Uh, but yeah, it reset some stuff. Uh, you did a complete install. I did fresh install, so my system is running awesome. Uh, at least, you know, fingers crossed, it's running awesome. Uh, everything seems to be doing really well. Uh, I was having some issues, like, loading into Valhalla. And it would just take forever. And, uh, you know, I was doing some research and everything, comparing my system to the system some of the other guys had. And uh, really it came down to who had 16 gigs of RAM and who had 32 gigs of RAM. And anyone that had th uh, 32 really wasn't having any problems logging in uh, for the most part. So there was a few outliers here and there, but for the most part it didn't really seem to matter. But what I'm going to be doing today is apparently killing this T-Rex. Uh, but uh, I'm going to be gathering some crystal because I want to start work on a, um, a greenhouse. I haven't set up a greenhouse over at the new base yet, uh, and I really need to. We're kind of getting to the point where a lot of my vegetables are running out and everything, so that's something that I want to work towards. So I need to start gathering this stuff. Um, on top of that, uh, let's go ahead and transfer some of this stuff that's not really necessary all of that and everything uh, on top of that uh, I also want to work on a little project when you guys I think over on Twitter or maybe it was on the forums I'm on the arc forums um, so if you guys want to hit me up over there you can as well I try to respond as much as I can in all the places but you know sometimes I miss stuff or sometimes I get busy but um, yeah, he hit me up over there on the, the ARC forums and showed me a maze. And I think a maze would be pretty awesome to make. Uh, and so I might work on that project here pretty soon. I just have to pick out a good location. Because I'm not sure where the best spot would be to do a, a fairly large maze system. Um, you know, not, not super huge or anything like that. Just fairly big. And uh, I think he was using... Um, like fence foundations and stuff like that. So I, it's going to be quite a bit of resource gathering to get up to a point to where I can start to build that freely. But uh, I think it could be really cool and uh, really neat. Just a, a fun little mini game. You know, that's the kind of stuff that we like to add to the server. You know, XB did that, uh, that arena. And then I've done the FPS style arena where me and Slip got to fight. And, uh, you know, it was just, it was just good fun. So yeah, uh, I'm going to spend some time up here. I'm going to gather some crystal. If you guys like this episode, please hit that like button. If you haven't already, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe. It helps me out a whole heck of a lot. We're ever so close to 100,000 subs. And uh, I'll see you guys back in a second. All right, guys, we are back. And I am ready to start building a greenhouse. That's right. I'm thinking... I'm thinking where the best spot might be to put this. Now, you know, greenhouses, they need a lot of a lot of sunlight, a lot of stuff here. Uh, but they also... Something attacking the wall up there, probably, if I had to guess. Um, I was thinking, like, right here would be a really good spot. Uh, only because the water is right there. Is that an alpha? No. Okay. <laughs> I thought I saw an alpha there for a hot second. All right. So this thing... Uh, it's only going to be a 3 by 4 you know, I'm not going to have it be huge or anything. Uh, but over here in the corner might not be bad. Um, trying to understand where it might need to go. Let's go ahead and take out some of these trees over here. I think this back here would actually be a really great spot. It's out of the way. Uh, it adds, you know, to the area here a little bit. It's really, really close to water. And I think it just could make for a pretty decent spot so let's go ahead and clear out some stuff here go ahead and pick up these rocks I know the fight music's happening could go up there and kill the guy but you know what you gonna do brother uh, <laughs> watch too much wrestling lately all right 
pick up everything we've got around here, and then uh, we can set the first foundation down right there. Go in with metal foundations, and then we're going to go four back. Yeah, I think so. Four back. Three. Here we go. That should make it nice for all of those. We're going to go ahead and place our door frame right there up front, and then... You know, because these things, they really don't need to be that big. Um, I even think, you know, a, a three by four is probably bigger than I necessarily need, to be honest. Let's go ahead and put that in. We'll go ahead and we'll put a door in. Um, You know what? I might hold off on the door for just a bit uh, because I might want to try and uh, get a dung beetle again. Since our last one died to a Conotaurus. Um, oh, I need two more walls. But uh, let's actually, let's go make those two walls here real quick. Uh, two more walls. You know, I was kind of thinking, like, I don't see it. Maybe you guys can point this out to me. Um, I was looking through the Ingrams list here, and you can see you've got... Um, Greenhouse, 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 but there's a greenhouse window. And I don't I don't understand. There there doesn't look to be anything but a metal window frame. I can't find anything about a greenhouse metal uh, window frame. So is it just me? Or, you know, did that get completely overlooked when they added this stuff in? I I don't know if I've I've talked about this already. Or what, or, you know, if this is just a common knowledge, it's just something I noticed when I was kind of messing around here, and it was like, really? There's no greenhouse door frame? Like, why? <laughs> I just, I couldn't, I couldn't quite wrap my head around why they would do that. But, you know, uh, to each his own, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, but yeah, let's see here. We got our two frames now, so let's go ahead and run back over. All right, get this guy, come up in here, and there we go, there we go, very nice. Now, I'll put my ceilings in here, just like so, there we go, very nice, very nice. I'm going to move these up ever so slightly, that way I can actually reach them on my keyboard. And then we'll just kind of get these guys set in here the way that they need to be. Okay, get that one. That one. All right, very nice. We've got the start of our greenhouse. Uh, like I said, I'm going to leave the door off for the time being just so I can go and get uh, a dung beetle. Um, you know, something I might want here is I might want a metal ramp. I might want a metal ramp to be able to go uh, inside with no problems whatsoever. So let's grab one of those. I don't even know that I have the ramp. Uh, Ingram. Now I do. Structures, metal, and ramp. Easy enough. I've got a lot of stuff cooking. I've got a lot of metal upstairs uh, cooking in the forge. Um, and then once we throw this on, I might run out to go get a dung beetle. And uh, I might bring you guys back here. But let's go ahead and throw this on, see what it looks like. I like the way it looks over here. Just kind of off in its own little spot and everything. And very nice and tidy. Let's see. Can I get it to go down a level? No? Is that is that going to cause any issues getting in and out? Sure not. All right. Well, uh, like I said, I'm going to run and try and get a dung beetle. And I'll bring you guys back here in just a hot second. All right, before I headed off to go get the dung beetle, I wanted to go ahead and set up the irrigation for this area. So I want to go ahead and lay down my crop plots. So let's go ahead and do that. There we go. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. There we go. These are all medium crop plots. I don't remember that it matters. I, you know, it's one of those things. I, I've set this up once already this season, but I, I it had it all torn down by a Carnotaurus and um, kind of, you know, got messed up here a little bit so i'm i'm thinking that all of this stuff is going to be just fine 
uh, in all honesty. But, uh, you know, we, you never know. Um, but, yeah, all right. So let's go ahead and start with putting these pipes in. And I want to put these in kind of in a strange way. And I think this is going to work out pretty well. But, you know, we got to test it. There's all the testing in the world that's got to happen with these things, right? Um, so number six, there we go. And then number one, nope, not number one, number four. And then that will leave me this number six right there. So that should, for all intents, intensive purposes, all intents and purposes. I don't know. How do you, how do you say that? Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and stick that one on there. And then I want to throw in an incline pipe. Uh, vertical, incline, yeah, let's just go incline, or decline, I guess, in this case. Uh, let's open up the door. Nothing really out here. Good, good, good. All right, now, uh, four, four. Nope, that's not a decline. This is a decline. There you go. Gosh, I keep hitting number one. All right, and then another decline and then does this work oh it does awesome okay so those are fed farm yeah everything is irrigated nicely awesome 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 i like it they're out of the way you can hardly see them and they kind of look like a sprinkler system almost so that is awesome. Now, you know, if something happens and it gets destroyed, it's not the end of the world. Uh, but, you know, it, it, you know, stuff could happen. Stuff could definitely happen. But, yeah, let's go ahead and take a look here. I don't think I have the materials for a water reservoir, but let's go ahead and take a look. And I'm missing five Zimindi Bay. Yeah, I don't have that on me. But, all right, now it's time. I have to go and try and get a dung beetle. Got to. Just got to. All right, guys, I am here in the cave, and I was just checking my FPS. I was getting over 60 FPS there for a minute, and I was, like, all excited. But, yeah, let's look for a dung beetle here. We're, we're flying into the cave. As far as I know, this is about the only cave you can take an Argentavis into. But I need to find a dung beetle, and I need to find one fast. Because this is my speed bird. This is not my attack bird. I guess I can't go up any further through there. All right, let's see here. Find a dung beetle. And then grab them and get out, right? Right, yeah. Oh, whoa. Whoa. Whoa! What on earth was that? Did you guys see that? Holy cow, that scared me. I was like, I... I was I was scared there for a second, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, where are the dung beetles? I'm not seeing these guys anywhere. Oh, nope, that's a Titan Boa. That's a Titan Boa, not a dung beetle. <laughs> um got all excited. I seen something low moving to the ground. Alright, let's go up back up oh uh oh. What's happened? Oh man. Um, guys, oh, geez, where am I? I don't know where I am. Oh, man, that was freaky. All right, get back up here again. No, no, why is it doing this? Why? I'm going to fly up here to this. Nope, can't go that way. Why is it doing this? Oh, geez. Oh, man. All right. Can't go up that way. Gotta go out this way. Find a dung beetle. Find one. Somebody say hello. Oh, there's one. There's one. Got one. Got one level 68. Doesn't even matter. All that matters is I got one. And then let's get out of here. All right, that was really strange, guys. I can't really believe what was happening there. Um, definitely really strange. Something I have never seen before in Ark, especially going into the caves. That uh, that was one for the books. All right, getting the little dung beetle inside the house here. The greenhouse, that is. And hopefully going to get him to stay in here. 
All right, we got that. Now we're going to go ahead and put the door on the place. That way he can't get out. And I guess at this point we need a couple of things. We need some seeds. We need some poo-poo. There we go. There's some. None from you. None from... Oh, oh. Get a little stuck there. All right. Any of these from these guys over here? Yeah, I'll pick that up. I'll take that. Thank you. Um, always got to clean up after your animals, guys. You just got to. You just got to. All right, none from the little guys over here. Uh, what about devil dinosaur? You got you got something laying around? Yeah, you sure do. Okay, what about you three fine ladies and gentlemen up here? Nice. Okay. So that can go on the dung beetle as soon as we get ready. And then, ooh, woolly rhino poo. That's new. I don't think I've had woolly rhino poo yet. Oh, there's some more. Very nice. That de decomposed in one minute. Do you all see that? Oh. I forgot I can't go through that door. All right, right here. Dun, da, 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 da. Let's run over here and grab some seeds. I'm sure our Brontosaurus has some seeds on him. So let's type in seed. There we go. Oh, we'll just take all of them because we can. And I don't know that I'm going to use any of them yet because I don't think I have that much fertilizer. I don't really, to be honest with you, I don't think I have any fertilizer because even if I did, I don't know where it would be. Like, I'd assume that it'd be over here somewhere, but I don't, I don't, I don't have the slightest inkling of an idea of where it would be. So, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to run over here. Jump off the cliff. All right. Getting ever so close to our dung beetle. Do you have some poo, poo for us as well? You do, you do. Okay. Oh, oh, I have the poo poo. Okay, where's my poo poo? There we go. All right. So if I remember correctly, these things don't have a whole lot of weight. <laughs> so uh, medium. These are large. Jeez. All right. So let's put some small on there. Get as many of those on as we can, and then the my human faces are also very tiny in comparison. All right, so we can get a lot of that on there. And then I think we put these guys on Wander. And that should get his, get their their juices flowing. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look here. We have Mejos, we have Narcos, Tintos, Amar, Azul. Long Grass is going to be one necessary. Uh, we're going to need some Citronol. We're going to need some Rockaroot. And we're going to need some Sava Root. And then over here, I think I am going to put in some Narcotic Berries. There we go. And I think I kind of think I'm going to fill this whole side with Narco Berries. And that should get us started. So, um, you know what? We're going to have to wait uh, just a little bit longer for these guys to go ahead and start to process this stuff. But I think with that said, I think we're just about done for today. I think we've got everything set up that we needed to have set up. I think it works out really well. The dung beetle is going to be a nice addition to the familia. And uh, I think this has been a good one, guys. But for now, my name is Drax. I hope that you enjoyed this episode of Ark Survival Evolved here on the Pooping Evolved server. And I shall see you next time. Have a good one.